Hello everyone, this is Way Off Trail, Select Star Gaming, and today we're back with some Gloomhaven. Uh, we have Xantok, or we're going to be taking on the Deep Ruins first off. We have Xantok as the Sawbones, we have myself as the Bladesworm, we have Zoe as the Mind Thief, and we have Dodds for the first time as the Spare Weaver. There you go. Um, so yeah, and uh, I think we're ready to to do this, yeah. Oh. Are we? <sighs> Fine. Deep inside a dense forest, you begin to hear the jangling of bells? It's a small troop of performers approaching you through the trees. Well, look who it is. The small voice belongs to a garishly dressed female quadro with a loot and a feathered hat. Fancy running into you out here. This actually may be a stroke of luck, the soothsinger singer says. You see, my, compad my compatriots and I seem to be a bit lost. We were headed toward the capital, but my drummer said he knew a shortcut. Now, here we are in the middle of the forest, without an inkling of a clue. I don't suppose you could uh, find it in your heart to escort us back to the main road, could you? Option A, take the time to escort the troop back out of the forest. Or option B, give detailed directions about the way out and hope that is sufficient. Well, I mean, I'm down for either it's option. It's a singer. Yeah, both both seem good. Either option. Fuck you. <laughs> option A. I was like, they both seem fine. To be fair, B would probably be like a no effect one, and A will probably be like you get this but discard two cards. Yeah, that's so what I was thinking. A. Yeah. It's always you know. Pull, pull the story hook until it's about something with Sam talks here. Because it's like, eh, I don't really care about this one. No, like, hey. Fuck you, sir. No, not I you. Said, not no, you. I'm saying they him. both seem him. fine. I don't know why you're getting uh -huh. at me. Yeah, you're apathy, bitch. Well, I can see both giving things. Well, let's go the Sioux singer and her troop out of the forest. You were able to catch up a bit. She is very happy now as a traveling performer, playing the sold-out concerts across the land. When you reach the main road... You say your goodbyes, and then make the long trek back to where you were going. Gain one reputation, and discard two cards each. I'll hmm. discard that card. Discard. And I'll discard that card. We get a hmm. reputation. Let's see, I was right. No, I'm actually mad. Are the other ones are better. Did somebody do the reputation? Well, see, here's the thing about that. Yeah. Kind of max. Oh. No. Oh. Well. Yeah. So we need to be meaner to people. I'm I'm good just continuing <laughs> to be nice to people actually. Sir, I'm a doctor. I, I, Ignore the gigantic hand saw with was, blood on it. I was about it. to say. I am a doctor. <laughs> Deciding the bray of the, the dark passages beneath the Gloomhaven sewers, you light a torch and head deeper down. Ruined brickwork eventually gives way to passages made of intricate stone in a state of extreme disrepair. You see an unrecognizable runic language etched into the walls. It would be hard to read, even if you knew the language, because of all the fractures and missing chunks of stone. Following the passage, you eventually make your way to a larger room full of ruined machinery you cannot begin to understand. You see a door on the opposite wall, but as you step forward, a clinging sound rings out through the room, almost like an alarm. Then, the machinery moves and springs to life, clearly intent on attacking any intruders. That would be you. Special rules! Add three minus one cards to each character attack modifier deck as a scenario effect, Whew. unless you ignore those. Phew. Our entire squad does. Wrong. Woo. You don't. Exactly. Neither do you, actually. Duds? Yeah, you don't either. Our entire squad ignores these, he says, as half the squad <laughs> 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 including the person speaking the statement. 
probably because oh. he's used to be B star. <laughs> That's funny. Just fun how that. All, all our squad does. Times, you know? Two don't. <laughs> our entire squad doesn't mean this. The squad. What? <laughs> we are? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we'll click some buttons. Let's kill some shit. New round! Artillery is gonna demobilize uh, an area. Called it. Fun. Stone Golem is gonna do a range and then suffer some damage. Also fun. Alright. Boogie Boy, Mind Thief, take some med packs. Ooh. Okie dokie. Uh, that's that's why one? I moved in the yeah. middle. I'm also gonna go over here. So that hopefully I don't get targeted. Mm. Huzzah! I feel like we are gonna need those uh, med packs pretty soon here. Yeah, that's why I uh, I did that. Blade swarm. All right, uh, I'm going to use the bottom of bone daggers to move forward, jump, and anyone I move through suffers damage. One, two, three, four. So both these cannons suffer a damage. Um. And then I'm going to use Sunstroke on, let's go the, this cannon, number four. Uh, so he's going to get Wound Stunned, Light Gets Created. Um, this will be a base of three, and I'm going to use my Black Knife, just to get Curse in there too. Let me add that. Alright, base of three. Plus zero, so that'll be three damage to the cannon. Um, and I believe that is going to be it. Spellweaver. Hey, I am... Oh, we should probably see what he, what he gets. Oh, right, we should. Uh, what number was that? Because it's gone now. It's Oh, it's on my spot. He, he yeah. needs to click it. Yeah, click oh, it. There it goes. All right. The Field Falchion, which is oh. actually a nice card. For the record, it says design, which I believe that means it just goes into the deck. Uh, into, into the, the shop. Shop, yeah. Hmm, and I just spent all my money. Uh, I, I am a fan of the food yeah. field option. During your single target melee attack, the target and all enemies adjacent to the target suffer one damage. Hmm. Pretty it's good. a nice weapon. I just got the, uh, oh, because other people didn't see it. I got the Sword of the Sands. I bought my special weapon in between games. And sold my one I never used. Spellweaver! Okay. New character, who dis? <laughs> yeah, never heard of you before. Alrighty, I am going to. Let me go check what they're, what they're doing. Ooh, a try shot. I don't want to get us a uh, multi shot, so I am going to move here. And actually, no, I'm going to move one, two, and I'm going to shoot at the ancient artillery in the back because the front one is stunned. Um, with that movement, I am going to pick up the... Uh, you already picked up that thing. So I'm going to pick up the fire and shoot that for four damage. I wish I'd shot the one in front, but oh well. Yeah, one in the back. And that's gonna be it. Mind Thief. Oh, keep Doki, I am going to use my little booty boots to make it so I can move seven instead of four, create dark, and poison anyone I walk through. And I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> and then I am going to consume the dark to add curse and poison to the two people I am targeting 
And I'm gonna shoot these two cannons right here. Because I don't... Oh, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Should I shoot the other two cannons that are already injured so that way they get poisoned as well? Oh, uh, yeah, probably. Alright, so I'll shoot the two cannons that are not poisoned and I'd curse them. I'll shoot one, then four. Okay. And it's for a base of three. Ooh, I'm gonna do my XP and create ice as well because that happens. Survey says for the first one it is plus zero, so just three damage. And for the other it is a plus two. So five. Mm, das is my turn. Did you say there was other suspects or was it just poison? Uh, there would have been two curses at it as well. Okay. Alright, ancient artillery. Number one, it's gonna attack the blade swarm. Oh, yeah. Curse! Hey. But you're still immobilized. Ooh. Number two and number six are gonna attack the mine thief. Mm -hmm. That's going to be two damage to the Mind Thief. And then a curse. Nice on the curses. Oh, yeah. And then the Golem is also going to be attacking the Mind Thief. Mm -hmm. That is eight damage. You certainly made a choice in not backing up for anything. Actually, I might just lose a card instead of doing that. Yeah, that's not a terrible idea. <laughs> it's a lot. I gotta like put it on again. And what card shall I lose? This one. No, <laughs> go away. This no one. way. Mm, yeah, okay, I'm okay with that one. Cause I don't have to go the other way. You guys are going that way. Okay. Well, in the round. This music makes me think we're laying in a cave or some shit. Yeah. I know, I just wanted to pick something different. Uh, so it gives me like the glittering cave vibes from yeah. uh, Gen 6. I was, I was actually thinking more of a, uh, like we're about to fight Calcabrina or something like that. Ooh. I mean, right. you do fight them uh, in well, a cave, I'm fairly certain. They're talking about that. Um, or is it the palace? I need to. It's sort of like a palace. It's still and underground. Move to yes. attack. To immobilize. Well, I can't. Okay, I could for sure kill it with this. Because hmm. that'll apply wound and wound will automatically kill it. I can't move either way. So. Oh, you know what? I think that's perfect. Because then I can summon. How oh, about the coins there? I can't remember. Can you summon on top of a coin? Yes. Maybe. Does? I think you should be able to, because I don't think coins should count as it, occupied spaces. The only thing, the only time you, wrong. the only time you can't is, uh, um, is if it says uh, unoccupied. Isn't that for all summons though? It says unoccupied space. Because it doesn't say on the cards. That's just in the rule book then. Oh no. Wait, check. Nope, it has, to, it has to summon on empty hexes. That's kind of what I thought it was. Stupid. I think it's stupid. stupid. <laughs> Coin should not take up space. Agreed. Mm, well, in that case, I'll do that. Mario's Herc. Uh, in that case, I'm just going to try and get my. Uh, I've killed the cannon, obviously, but I'm. Uh, I should kill the cannon. I can't move, so I figured, you know what, I might as well try and I uh, get my I poisoned everything in the room. 
Congratulations. You did. Good job. Take Let's see what you can do next. Die. Artillery is going to try and push people away. Hat. And hit all adjacent. Mm -hmm. Well, pushing all adjacent, rather. Golem, weak, spell weaver. Okay, um. I'm going to move one. I'll check my range on this. Yeah, don't worry about the bottom cannon. I got him. I can't go anywhere anyway. Two. Uh, is just doing weak attack, so if we take that, we'll target the cannon in the back. And I'm going to be consuming the light here to make all adjacent enemy, all enemies adjacent to the target suffer too. The big torch that is going to be six, seven damage after poison, and then the other cannon takes suffers too. Which one's the primary uh, target? That one. Gotcha. And ice goes back up. Alright. Mind thief. Okay, I am going to... I was just going to shoot the golem so he didn't move, because I know that I'm probably not going to get through his shield. So just the base two is going to be immobilized, and I get an experience. And survey says minus one, so yeah, it doesn't go through shield, but he's immobilized. And then I was gonna invisible myself because I'm a bitch. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> wow. <laughs> See if I heal you. <laughs> All right, artillery number one pushes you. Oh, it, it, it can't really. Wall. Okay. And so that's going to do two damage to you. Uh, is it just a melee attack? Ah, right. Uh, it's going to do one damage to you. That's right. As for cannon two and six, guess that they're shooting. Not the mind thief, bitch. Cannon two is actually going to shoot the uh, spellweaver. Uh, by the way, the other one is still shooting the mind thief. Uh, mind thief is invisible, sir. Yeah. Zoe, I can't see your, um, they're just white boxes for me. I can't, so, like, if you have then something... You, then you need to leave and reload. It's not uh, no, on it, her, it's it, on you. No, it always happens for me with Mind Thief. It's the only character it does it to. So you'll that have to... no sense at all. I don't know. So, Zoe, you'll have to, if, like, you have, uh, immobilize, mm -hmm. you'll have to get rid of it yourself. Yeah. And I'll say. No damage from the cannon. And then the cannon six is actually going to shoot Spellweaver as well, because I'm slower by a lot. It's going to be three damage to the Spellweaver. All right, and they all now have shield too. Blade Swarm. Uh, all right. Well, I'm going to first off uh, do the bottom of Blood Drain to attack two target two, but I'm only target the one. It's a base two, but it will add wound. Uh, so that is a plus one poison. So that'll be three base to our dude there. And because of, and because I applied wound to him before he died, I completed my battle goal of applying another negative condition to a monster already afflicted by one. Yeah. Accurate. Um, and then I'm going to use the top of incubation to heal one. Add a retaliate and shield and create uh, that. Not that I think it's going to matter, but I have it up now. So that is it for me. All right, Stone Golem. He cannot move. All oh, right, but and that's I thought that was he's doing range again, but he's not. All right, so he's done. That brings it to me. I am going to be moving. And getting right here. And hey, Mind Thief, uh, go ahead and heal up the full. Okay. And then I'm going to hit this cannon. Ooh. 
So that's a eight damage. They have two shield. Ah, oh, no, with the poison, he's dead. Oh, nice. <laughs> dead cannon. Hell yes. All right, in the round. Hmm. All right, I can move again. Uh, I think I might just get. Oh, I could. If I could move three, I could attack both. Okay. You don't want the ice, do you, Dodd? Want to attack yeah. and mobilize? I do want the ice. Okay. Um. Or do, actually, you know what? You can. You can use it. I've got options. All, all my bottoms are moves, Ready. pretty much. Um, I'm gonna smack big boy. Smack mm. the big boy. <laughs> smack him. Yeah, I mean, I could attack mm. multiple. I think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna attack multiple, and then make it so I can't get a uh, negative. I mean, or I could sit and summon, but I can't. Do much more on myself. We'll just let it slide. Flip them. All right, golem. Basic artillery. Ooh. Okay. All Jason will take two damage. But blade swarm, you're up. All right. I'm going to use the bottom of omniscient assault to move two. I'm gonna go. Yeah, I'll go here. Um, and then if I get a, uh, crit miss, it will be counted as zero instead. Um, and then I'm going to attack Mr. Golem for a base of three. Um, uh, cause I can't reach the other guy. Uh, do I want to add that? No. Okay. Uh, base three, uh, plus one, four damage, five with poison. Two with the shield. Okay. Um, and what is Stone Golem doing this round? Basic shit. Um, you know, I'm gonna summon the uh, skeleton. I'm gonna summon Mr. Skelly. We'll put him here. Okay, that'll be my turn. Spellweaver. Okay, I am going to just move and move two. Actually, yeah, and shoot the uh, golem with. Right, I, no, no, shoot them both with the uh, fork beam, starting with the golem. No damage, and a crit of uh, four damage onto the cannon. You said four? Four, yeah. Alright, Kaden's gone. And then just basic move down to here. That's it. Okay. Well, that makes my target easy. Excellent. I am gonna move here and smack this guy with Gentleman's Anger. So, wrong button. He is gonna get disarmed. Ooh. Why is that correct? Minus one. So four damage, five at the poison, two at the shield. Golem is disarmed. Mind thief. Okay, I'm going to use Withering Claw to move three and just go one, two. And then I'm going to use my Wand of Darkness to create dark and uh, immediately consume that and the ice gain two experience for it and attack big boy for a base of six nice and survey says plus two ice created so that's all right eight damage five damage here. no six damage after shield mm -hmm. nice right back up good job you have ice for next round if you want it, Todd's. All right, next round. Hmm. Yeah, I also play these. Uh, I'm kind of at a part now where I'm in trouble here. Um, 
because I've got summons left, but that's about it. Um, one adjacent valley, some valley owned gets to do stuff. Attack and mobilize. Uh, yeah, because my bottom cards aren't. I mean, I can move six. I don't need the money, though. I'm just going to be completely honest. I don't really care about the money. Um, I mean, I could... If they don't kill it, I could try and kill it if I go slow. And just use, like, a base attack. Um, okay. And then I could move and summon stuff if needed. Oh, and I'm no longer invisible. So like, I really like my creeping beetle, so I can move more. Okay, so I want my beetles, and then I'm going to go, I think I'm going to use this as a base movement. I'm really hoping they kill it. You know what? I'm going to hope that they kill it, and I'm going to go slow, and I'm going to move. That'll be my first card, and then I'll do... Honestly, this is a terrible card. I'm going to use that for my movement. And flip, flip them. them. Alright. Golem has a strong attack. Spellweaver. Still faster than the Golem, so I can decide if it gets on my turn. So that's good. Hey, I am going to just move on to this coin, because I don't really want to move into the room. Um, because so I don't get probably annihilated. Okay, I'm not getting experience from anything else, so... Yeah. Mind thief. Okay, I guess I'll attack big boy. Oh, do you want to kill him, Xantok? I mean, I do want to kill him, but I won't be able to with, my, with this attack, so go for it. Hit him. Okay, well, I'm going to hit him with the base of free, and I guess I'll consume the ice because it'll go away anyway to stun him and get an experience. And survey says it's plus zero, just no damage to him. Well, one because poison. And right. I could have attacked him and strengthened myself, but are we going to go into the new room next round? I think so. All right, well, then I'm going to attack him with the base Unless... one just... Oh, yeah, we still have that chest, by the way. Ooh, go get it, then. <laughs> um, I'm going to attack him again with just a base of one to strengthen myself for next round. And Seve says... Plus zero, no damage, but I am strengthened now. Okay. Alright. I am going to hit him with Hand of the Surgeon. Oh. Oh, fuck. I I do no damage. Not God poison? damn it. Not even with the poison. The poison brings it up to three. Damn. <sighs> but he's double stunned. <laughs> All right, I'm also going to use Bloody Saw to loot, so I get this coin. I guess. I was hoping to get his coin, too. <laughs> Blade Swarm. <laughs> Uh, my skeleton attacks, probably not doing anything, plus zero, I don't think he has enough attack. Nope. Um, not even with poison. Okay, uh, I wasn't planning on attacking, so there's that. Um, let's see. Well, I guess I could grab the chest if I use my... Oh wait, no I can't. No, never mind, I can't use the chest. Get the chest turn. Okay, um, I'm going to move base of two. I'm actually going to go this way. And I'm going to summon a creeping beetle. And put him over here. So that now I have more movement. And that will be it for me. It's 
Swim goal almost stunned. Next round. You guys want to kill this thing now? <laughs> One, two, three, four. Okay, four will get me to the chest. And it sounds like they have no desire to go to the chest. I'm going to go as fast as I can to try and kill it. Okay, so then I'm, I'm going to do being alive. that. And I'm going to get my slow-moving uh, <laughs> summon out so I can hopefully get some stuff. I might have an issue. Oh, Zoe, issues. we know. We know. A few issues. Yeah, I might waste my strength then because I didn't check what I had in my hand. Oh, by the way, Zoe, Dodds found out the other day that we make fun of you. Mm hmm? By a long-running joke that you don't find funny that we do that shouldn't be funny. What's that? That you're 12. Oh. <laughs> Just the, oh, yeah, that. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't know we did that. And then he found out that you've been like my longest viewer on Twitch. Mm. Yeah, even though they bully me. Mm-hmm. You hear that Twitch? They're bullies. What? <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Mind thief. <laughs> I said as fast as I could, not fast. <laughs> the two cards I had left in my hand. It was my fastest card! The 12 um, and a 5. <laughs> um, do you want me to open the door or? Uh, At this point, we. I'm almost thinking we might as well, just because we should Yeah, be honestly, yeah, that's thing. a good point. Okay, well then I'm going to use Master Zero, no, not Master Zero, uh, Cranium Overload to move five. And I'll ah, go... you open the door! One, two. We have words. But these words say the following. You fight your way through the room of machinery and find corridors heading to your left and right. You hear the alarm ringing from both directions. To shut it off, you may have to split up. Special rules! There are a number of pressure plates equal to the number of characters. For two characters, oh no, we'll skip that. For four characters, the plates A, B, and C exist. This matters because our goal is to occupy all pressure plates simultaneously. So, that's all we gotta do to win. Alright. Now we gotta add in some uh, combatants. Nah, that's fine. Oh, they're skellies. Hi, skelly. Yeah, we got some living bones and ancient artillery. So, uh. There's that. Mm -hmm. And there's this. Mm. Alright, uh, have fun. Okay. One, two, three. I don't want to be in the doorway. <laughs> it's scary, man. Um. At least the golems aren't moving, but they have a range attack. <laughs> yeah. And also, we're in the doorway, both of the artillery can hit me, uh, and the skelly bobs can make it to me. Oops. And that's what I'm saying, I don't want to be here. <laughs> well, just go invisible in the doorway. <laughs> <laughs> this, this option's gone. I'm just going to go one, take... Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that you're moving. <laughs> I'm trying to decide where I want to move to. I have three more movements. I mean, you can get a. Remember, you have the leather armor, so they're gonna. So you can have you can stop an attack with the disadvantage. So, uh, if she stays in the doorway, she will get shot by both cannons. If yeah, and I'll get attacked by both skelly bobs too. Well, and the yeah. golems. And the golems. Yeah. yeah. So recommendation. <laughs> well, only if are... nobody else joins you in that room, which they might. I will not be <laughs> doing that. I won't. <laughs> well, yeah. There you go. So I'm gonna step back here. That way they cannons are at least out of the road. Um, and then I can hit 
four things, but I think I can only see two now. Mm hmm. Correct. And one's at disadvantage, but that's okay because I'll use my strength on him so that way it evens out. Even though I doubt I'm going to hit anything, I'm just going to muddle it. But I am creating ice, no, not light, ice for anyone that wants to use it and giving myself an XP. Uh, I'll start with the golemy 2 that I'm going to use my strength on so that way it isn't at disadvantage and then I'll hit the other golemy. So I think you keep strengthened for the whole attack round. I thought you have to pick one. Mm -mm. No, no, it's for the... Okay. Oh, okay. Well, then if I'll... It, was... oh. it depends on how the card is structured. Okay. If it's strengthened, it's for your entire round. Okay, well, I'm still going to attack two and then five. And survey says... Minus one. Oh wait, but strength, no, it even out because that's even out the case. Yep. Nothing on him, but the other one is either a plus two ice or just a plus two. Well, ice is already up, so it doesn't matter. And what's the total of that then? Uh, three. Okay. One damage with the poison. Uh, not this guy. And what the fuck is she shooting? This, this guy. Oh, that, that guy. One. Yeah, that was the second ah, one. Yeah. All right, so then, uh, so one, I believe. Yep. Oh, he's only got two shield. Cool. Yeah. Addy, das is it. Alright, let's back to Sawbones. Trying to carve up a golem. Let's use the amputate. Oh. Plus one. So five, six with poison, three at the shield. Ah, oh, motherfucker. But, but, I gave him wound. So yeah, he's dying also, on his turn. He'll die. Yeah, so we don't need all, to worry about him anymore. All the status effects. Yeah. Let's see. Where, where can I move so that Vermling still gets attacked by everything? <laughs> <laughs> don't mean. <laughs> Back of the room, maybe? <laughs> what you say just a bit ago that, oh, yeah, we'll, we'll be the tank now. <laughs> I mean, yeah. What are they all doing, though, in actuality? Uh, the bones are doing basic, and they only have three damage. Actually, oh shit! I do need to move because otherwise they're gonna hit both of us. Well, one of them will at least, because they have multi. If you if you move, then both of them will hit me. No, one will stop in the door. Depending depending on where. Yeah, I go. and then the other one will go one. I'm, I'm saying if I don't move, then one of them is gonna hit both of us with one attack. Mm. That's what I'm saying. That's. Kind of the important sure. thing here. Sure. Uh, artillery. Okay, they only have four. They can't see anyone, but if you don't step they in the door. No, but this here. So my the best bet is honestly moving here. Mm. Sure, I've got that, your that, little med pack anyway. It's always making you feel so bad about moving. <laughs> I, I'm trying to think though, like what is like obviously like that's best for me. But if I here is best for that's bad for everybody. But yeah, don't no, do that. I, I would not call that bad for everybody. Well, you're gonna get hit by everything. It's, it's bad for me, but it's not bad for everybody. Yeah, true. But I. It's alrighty. I wanted to move into the room, but with the setup, yeah, they're not the best thing. Yeah, they're coming to mm -hmm. us. All right. In that case, living bones. Hi, friend. And the other one won't get to you. I'm just gonna move him now. So it's mine as well. Listen, asshole. Thank you. Uh, that was gonna be two damage to the mine thief. Boop boop. Blade swarm. My poor. Uh, my skeleton is going to make an attack against the golem. Plus one oh. wound. I think actually. Kills him. No, it doesn't. Yeah, poison. Well, yes, it does. Yep. So my skeleton actually got a kill. Whoa. Um, my Whoa. creeping beetles will move. Actually, they'll move this way. Um, all right. I am going to use. Uh, I'm going to summon some steel scarabs. While I'm over here, put them back here. Uh, because now I have a shield. While they're doing their thing. 
And then, because none of you wanted the chest, I'm going to go grab it. One, two, three, four. And uh, that will be it for me. And so the chest is number 39. Number 39, you say? No, Mimic. Well, Five damage. Pretty much. <laughs> Explains why no one yeah. was wanting those. <laughs> yeah, as soon as when the they one... put two chests in one in the opening room, you know they're not both gonna be nice. Yep. And since you got the good one. I love how Dodd's never <laughs> like I said, Dodd, you can get those. And he just didn't say anything. <laughs> like he didn't say, oh no, I don't, I don't want them. No, he just because one, well, Dodds has played this game like six times, and then two, Dodds and I are both a little genre savvy. <laughs> I and also, didn't, I didn't remember specifically which one was good, but I was pretty darn sure it was, it was the one that you immediately went for, and then as soon as you got it, I was like, yep, I know what the next one is. So. Yep. <laughs> and also, if he remembered wrong and got the bad one instead of the good one, that would have been like almost half his health gone. Yep. Sadly, though, there is no mimics that pop out of chests. That uh -huh. I really, I really hope in Frost Haven they do that. Yep, yeah, same. All right, so you're done, right? I mean, someone had to you're do done. it. So, all right, yeah, I'm done. Okay, so I'm going to basic move here, and I'll be picking up that coin. But I'm going to be attacking with impaling eruption against those two skeletons. Hmm. I've got my thing to recall card, so I might as well. Um, ice is up, so I'm going to be consuming the... I'm going to be using my robes of evocation to add plus one to this entire attack. Ice. And... Let's go closest to farthest. Darn it. I've gotten... Wait, did, the, did my last one disappear? I only see one thing. Mm. Oh no, because right. I got a crit, that's right. Mm -hmm. Um, so that is two damage after shield to the plus one. Ooh, uh, useless. Well, this was very uh, pointless. Uh, two damage to that one, and uh, uh, Earth is uh, created up twice. Earth or I, okay. I, I can't do it anymore. Well, okay. Right, artillery can't hit anything. Stone golem can. Hi, friend. All right, that's gonna be four damage. Short rest. I'm also short resting. Short resting. I think I can actually still get away with one more round. Die. Oh. I'm hoarding. Eww. I'm hoarding onto your uh, med pack. I mean, that's fine. It's my last card left. They're my... they're there to be used. Right. <laughs> oh, son of a. Nope. That won't no. work. No. No. Won't work. You can't do that. I, no, That's I can't. That's illegal. I can't. The skeleton will get in the way. Yeah. But you know what? I can. Uh, well, shoot. Well, butter my biscuit. Yeah, that actually kind of creates a problem. I, you don't want me to do that. What, to butter biscuits? <laughs> Yeah, you don't want me to butter your biscuit. I, no, yeah, no, I don't. Well, shoot, that kind of ruins my whole plan. I guess I'll summon. I'll use a med pack and... We only have six of butter. Or I use med pack top action. I don't even know what my butter's called. Move bottom action? I hope it's called butter. Hmm. Butter. Move to... Marjorie. I mean, I guess I could 
move Margaret. to the coin and Margaret. then heal. And then next round summon maybe. Well I'll have all my attacks back. I don't care for the bullet maggots to be fair. Uh we'll just I'm gonna go super slow, let everyone else do their thing. Flip. No. Wow, look at freaking uh, Sawbones. Bones are being hard. boring. Stone Golem was being boring. Ancient Artillery. Stronger attack. Alright, Burmling, Mind Thief. I'm gonna heal myself four. And then. I did not realize I was next to him. I should not. I should have realized that, but that is okay. I am going to. Oh, for my down. So far, let's do. I'm only down two. So I'll use my little emlet of life to heal up another one. And then I'm going to just attack them with. Shared nightmare. They're not gonna get poisoned or cursed unless I use my sun earring. No, I don't want to do that yet. Ah, screw. No, I'm not. I'll do it next round because I'll lose health this round. Um, sorry, I'm in my own world. And then, see, so yeah, I'm gonna attack Skelly Bob four and. Can I see him? Yes, I can see him. And Stone Golem Boy. For a base of three. And I'll attack Stone Golem, then Bonesy Boy. And survey says... Plus Five. Oh, right, yeah, two because she shields. And then for the Skelly Bob boy, it is plus one rolling plus zero. So four damage to the Skelly Bob boy. Das is my turn. All right. I'm moving up to here. Um. Uh... Trying to think who I want to give the head health back to. So Weaver is down, but you're not in. You don't get attacked a lot. Mind uh, you did damage the wrong Skelly Bob boy. Then... I didn't say that. Whatever. Take your med pack. I did. Good. All right. Now I'm attacking this skeleton. With the amputate, so he's gonna get wounded and mobilized. Minus one, so three damage, which goes down to two. But he's kinda fucked. Alright, Spellweaver. Hey. I oh, I've kind of made this a little worse since you're both occupying space in front of them. Run, just shoot me. Um, I guess I'm. I think I'm still gonna do it. Fire orbs onto both the skeletons, uh, left to right. Why do I keep picking up the elements that I'm? Or are you going to be picking up? That's uh, four damage after shield. And then two damage after shield. I, the, the, that one took four. And... Considering he gets slammed by that golem, I am just going to basic move right here and pick up the coin. 
That's it. Great. Golem. This is going to be bad. So that's four damage to the Mind Thief. You're welcome for the med pack. The artillery can't hit us. Bleed Swarm. All right, my buggies move forward ish. I guess I gotta go there. Um, all right, I am going to heal myself four. So you get your med pack back. Oh, oh there. Missed. There it goes. All right, and then I'm going to. Uh, I'm just gonna move. Um, I'm gonna move here just to get a coin, and it'll strengthen myself for next time. And that's it for me. All right, in the round. A short rest for me. Not allowed. Okay, fair enough. Goddamn right. Well, the card I thought about using was the one I got pulled to be discarded. I'm like, okay, there goes that decision then. I'll think about it now. Alright, they're kind of in the way. I can't do much. I mean, I could summon again, because I do have that one card that's really good with summons. So... I could summon some soul leeches. Uh, is a range for me to summon. Well, this summon ally is not within range three. Add plus one to all my attacks. So Hello? I mean, did you want ice dodge? I should probably. Um, do that. Not really. I, I can't really Oops. do anything because they're there. You can send the snow my way. I could heal my summons at the mm, beginning of no every thanks. turn. <laughs> if he doesn't want oh. it, I'll use it. <laughs> oh. Because I mean, no, I don't want to use that. I just want the snow. But... I want snow too. I've never seen. Um, Go to probably. America during the winter. I yeah, went I'm to just gonna Ireland and... during winter, and it was the hottest winter there. <laughs> Am I ever going to use the top of that? No. Okay. Go to Kansas during the winter then. Flip them. Hey, artillery. It's gonna be weird. Stone Golem, stronger attack. Spell Weaver. Hey, I'm just going to be shooting at the Golem. That is going to be three damage after shield, and ice is back up to full. And I'm gonna heal myself for three. And light was picked up with that attack, so... And it was three damage me. to him, wasn't it? Yeah, it was three damage to the goal of after shield, so... Alrighty. Mine, thief. That's me! Um, I'm going to then, I guess... Use my sun earring to heal three, boop, 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 and regain all of my spent items. And... Then I'm going to do three and a stun. That would be a good idea if he's going to hit hard. Yeah, stun's always good. Three and a stun if I don't kill him. So I'll consume the ice to make it a stun, gain an XP for it, and a base of three survey says plus one, four damage. Two at the shield. And I can move some buttons, I don't want to. 
Oh. And that's my turn. Wait, so it doesn't your bottom action allow you to attack? Yeah, but I, I wouldn't I'm be able to it. hit any of them and Xanto can kill it and mark it off his Oh, I Bobby. see what you're saying. Alright. Gentlemen's anger. Plus one instead. Yay! Yay. Get the fuck out of here. Alright, how's everybody's health doing? Oh, we're all. Oh, no, we're not all full. Okay. Uh, well, I don't want to step there because. <laughs> Actually, wait a minute. They're shooting with a range. They can hit us map. anyways. No, they can't. One, two, three, four, five. They oh, minus right one range. Through. Minus yep. one range. Okay, yeah. Yep. So they still can't. Then I'm going to stay here and mind thief heal up the full. Yay, me! All right, artillery does shit. Flight storm. Uh, my skeleton actually moves forward. He steps in the doorway. Uh, oh. This guy goes here. This guy goes here. Uh, I'm going to uh, get incubation started uh, so that I can heal my summons at any time, as well as summon another summon just because. Um, and Oh, I, I have not been giving myself XP for summons. I should really do that. And I'll summon my soul leeches up here. And that's gonna be it for me. The golem's dead. End of the round. End of the round. Yay. Alright, now we gotta start moving in there. Alright. So, one, two, three, Tyler, split four, up, five. gang! What's my fastest card? What kind of traps are these? these I can move are six, seven. Just oh, not, I don't want to waste that card, okay. though. I love that card. Uh, this is six here with okay. looting. Not oh. that I really care about the looting. Okay. They'll move me seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, We're seven. Going in. I can get up there. And I could damage. <sighs> I think I would be able to attack with... Um, there's one that has range. This one. I mean, it's not much, though. How much do these traps do? Six damage. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. I'll live. <sighs> this is one I wish I had range. There's normal damage traps, so... Yeah, I don't have anything good here. Five. What if... What if so if I move a five, one, two, three, four, five, six... I couldn't do it. Okay, so I think I have to use... Okay, I'm going to use my Grasping Advance to move up quite a bit. I'll lose that card, but that's okay. And then I'll use Bone Daggers to actually attack. So I'll actually get to do something for once. <laughs> Too bad those um, beans can't see each other. I, know, I could probably use the... Beans! Uh, it is a melee attack. I could use my Sword of Sands. Uh, oh, I, I might save that, though. We have a stone golem. Yeah, we have got a couple stone golems coming up in the next room, so. Oh, but we just got to step on the pressure plates, so. Um, hmm. That should be okay, I think. I also got a power core. I can summon it again. Probably be a good call. Oh, but I probably want to summon on the other side of the traps. Yeah. Well, I also got to figure out who's closer for my, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Two, three, four. They're both six, but there's traps here, so he would go this way, wouldn't he? I think so. So I think they're all gonna pri what they're all prioritizing doing? the bottom one. Being an idiot. That needs to go there. Man, that's a great question. <gasps> Incubation so slows me life. down though, doesn't it? Like yes it does oh shoot that's too late now all right blade swarm yeah okay uh skelly bob he's gonna move boop boop uh these two can't move uh this guy can uh wait your skelly bob would go up uh I, they are both the same distance traps. but this one's got traps in the way so he can't go that way yeah yeah traps oh the, the traps right 
Alright, uh, so then I am going to use the bottom of Grasping Advance to move six, and it will loot everything that I go through, which is alright, I guess. Um, Cute money, hawk. <laughs> yeah, for the one coin I'm going to go through. One, two, three, four, five, six. There's Unfortunately, it's as far as I can... Oh, there's two there. Uh, as far as I can go. Were you going to get them, Zoe? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> um, and then, unfortunately, I think he is out of range. One, two, three. Yep, I thought I had more range than I did. So, that's going to be it for me. Well, I'm going to follow that up by moving six and getting right here. I'm triggering this trap. I'm taking six damage. And immobilizing myself because I used hamstring to do all that. Aha. And then I'm going to hit this thing with Vital Strike. What's that going to be? Okay, seven. Uh, I'm going to throw on. I think the Poison Dagger is going to be the smarter bet in this case. Eight damage with poison. All right. And that will end my turn. Artillery. Here it goes. Oh, I meant to heal. Oops, oh well. All right, that's gonna be two damage to me. Oh, actually, wait a minute. That one's actually yeah. also going to shoot Blade Swarm. Mm -hmm. So that's going to be three damage to the Blade Swarm. Two after shield. All right, and, and then, then... Gonna die. Yeah, three. No, it's not actually. Oh, it is. Who's the only three I thought he had four? So yeah, skull, but skeleton's dead. <laughs> All right, mind thief. Goodbye, skeleton. I'm going to go. One, two, three. Two, three, four. four. Dodge, do you need this spot before I stand here? Because I can use my boots to move more. No, that's fine. I won't be able to reach anything. Okay, and I'm going to shoot the artillery with a base of two, and he's immobilized, and I create ice. Boop. And survey says. Plus zero, so just two. Hope he doesn't move at you, that'd be crazy. <laughs> Spell weaver. One, two, three, four. And heal up three late swarm. Alright, next round. Okay, uh, I need a, something, at least three movement to get to our cannon friend here. Uh, which limits me, I believe, to I have to use this card. Okay, attack wise, um, he's... <clears throat> I think I might just use... Uh, oh, Xantok's going to attack him too. And Xantok can't move. So, honestly, this is not a terrible decision either, if I could use this card. Um, model, uh, let's do the base two with the move five. That's the only way I'm going to be able to attack anything, so. And then all of my things are going to start heading up. Unless he dies this round, then it'll depend. Spellweaver. Hey, I'm going to move one... Oh, uh, Wait, what happened well, to my soul leech? double shot anyway, so one... While this summoned ally is two, not three. within range three, add plus one to all your attacks. Four, I would move on top of there, but this is a range attack. And uh, I'm going to pick up every element with Chromatic Explosion 
as I totally waste the AoE on uh, the attack. And... Uh, yep. Oh my gosh! One. Man, we really need to get mm -hmm. you some perks. Fortunate. Yep. Chugging... Well, I actually... <laughs> Way earlier, I actually completed my uh, ritualistic with killing a monster when two or oh wait no it didn't wait did I yeah I did kill a monster. Mhm. Mm yeah, when two or more elements were strong or waning. I feel like that's super easy for your character. I wonder why. Mm -hmm. Um, either way, I'm checking my major stamina potion. Get back three cards. Um, while I'm figuring those out, somebody else can go. All right, I'll just start moving my buggies. Uh, he's gonna go there, he's gonna go there, this guy would go here. Um, alright, and you're done with the so, uh, I'm going to use an overkill of movement to move up to here, and then I'm going to use Omniscient Assault to attack him for a base of two. Plus zero, dang it. Uh, so it'll be two damage, three with poison. And actually, uh, I get one more because my soul leeches are more than three away. I get a bonus to my attack. Um, so yeah, that will do it for me, I believe. Yep. All right. I'm going to use Hand of the Surgeon to kill it, hopefully. That is three damage. It's gone. Yay. And you get to add that to your log. Nope. I was already in there. Yep. <laughs> From the first room. Wow. Ah. Yeah, so it's different enemies that have to kill. Hmm. Yeah. Alright. Remaining artillery. Misses. And what about Mind me? Thief. Uh, yeah. he has oh, to right. shoot me as well. Yeah. Well, unfortunate. That's five damage. Ooh. That's okay. It's okay. I've got a med pack. Alright. Now it's my turn. I can move five. But I'm only gonna go one, two, three. Boop. And then I'm going to play the mind's weakness, where I can add plus two on L of my melee attacks, and then I get to attack this guy for one, which makes it three. And survey says just three damage. <laughs> and then I'm going to use my amulet of life to heal up one. That's my turn. All right, end of the round. All right, so Zentok, we're opening that door, right? Uh, yeah, I kind of figured we would. Okay, I have no movement cards left, so I gotta. <laughs> Maybe we don't then. I mean, we could long rest. I mean, I have my two guys. I'm gonna use them, but. I mean, I could short rest. It, it might be better, actually, if we just hold around to give them time to kill that cannon. Yeah. Because uh, since we don't have to kill enemies, we just have to trigger all the pressure plates. Right. Yeah. Just uh, so that we can run in there at the same time. Right. One advantage of actually going in right now is that once we start the round, we will know what the cannon's doing, but... Um, it's not that much of an advantage, so. I think. I don't know if I want a long rest. Actually, if we're just staying here, I will not. Wait, what do I get back if I long rest? Just that. Not worth it. Okay. Yeah, um, I think that's the best plan for me. Yeah, I have, I have terrible cards here for this, so. <laughs> I'll do oh, wait. this, I guess. Just to use up some stuff. Just pray I go before him, and if 
Not very well. Flip them. All right. Spellweaver. Okay. Going to start off by consuming wind for attacking with mana bolt. <laughs> and wind's right back. Wow. Um, that is four damage. And uh, I'm going to pull eight from the uh, ether. Ooh. Oh, smokes has a really cool. Look at more uh, summons. It's a really cool piece of art. That's just what we needed. More summons. Fuck. <laughs> hey, good news. It's not near you. Mm -mm. I'm running out of cards. Did you play your get all your cards back card? No. <laughs> All right, then shut up. That's it for me. Okay. Well, first of all, I'm going to he heal up three. I think it's time for that. I want to drink my major healing potion to heal a little bit more. You were a little low there. Yeah, I mean, that's what happens. And, uh... I'm, am I opening the door? Yes, no? I, I thought we were class? I thought we were taking a round. Yeah, but then Dodge was saying uh, an argument, but I wasn't sure if that was an argument, a strong enough argument or not. That's, uh, it's entirely up to you guys if you think it's uh, worth it. Well, my round is not going in that room, so... Alright, then I'm going to move right here. Blade Swarm. Oh, my buddies move... Actually, these two can't move, because they would go first. This guy would go second. Third. Uh, I'm going to then use the bottom uh, where I can control all my uh, summons and move them. And I'm just going to move them all back one. And then this guy, uh, I need him away from me. So I'm going to keep him actually in this back corner. And then for funsies, why not have another summon? my last summon that I can do. I, yeah, because I, I lost my other card. And this guy will join us right there. And that is my turn. I'm very mad about what this ancient artillery is doing. <laughs> I was praying that he wouldn't get that card, but of course that card had to be gone. Uh, so he pushes. So, he can't. He can't yeah, push, you. push. He's gonna push me. Push, yeah. yeah, he's pushing me back there. Uh, then he's gonna do an attack minus one range minus one. So he hits the summon and the spell weaver. Mm -hmm. Oh wait, it's area. Hold on. Where, where's the picture? Yeah, it would still go for those two because they're quicker. It's just a yep. triangle. Yep. He so can't hit all three of us. So he's yep. just gonna hit the two of you. <laughs> all right. On the. Uh, um, summon. Be summoned first. Already summoned. That's and fine. then I'm getting back immediately. <laughs> Missed you. No, oh, that's kind of an order. Sort of. Uh, I didn't want. Right. Backwards. Um. So I can either heal myself four, and be safe, or I can take a step forward and attack him. What I was going to and kill him. We what would you prefer me to do? Add him. So I'm going to use the Healy card to move, if it'll let me buy some, let me grab my card, there we go. Move up one, and attacking him for a base of two, and I don't get any XP because there's no med negative condition you on him anymore. XP, but... Okay, it's yeah, actually a base of four because of my Mind's a Weakness augment as well, not just two. So survey says plus one roll it. Oh no, I'm really worried because something hasn't come out yet. Oh, hey. Okay. 
you don't know what the bad thing is, but there is there is a miss in there somewhere. Oops. And it's scary. Why does it do this to me? There we go. Alright, that's the end of the round. Okay. I have to short rest, because I need some cards back. Of course, that's one of my move cards. Um, Zoe, are we gonna want to go in or um, just long rest and then we go in after that? Because long I'm rest. I'm fine with that. Me. Okay. And if you want a long rest. Let's uh, end the round. Would a long rest be beneficial for you, Bob? Uh, it would guarantee that I don't have to lose an HP to. Uh, uh, guarantee that I don't lose reviving ether. Okay. Not that it matters, but still. I'm just gonna do my long rest as well while we're sitting here. Actually, um, let's see here. Worry about that because uh, I can actually do something else. I can stun. Yeah, that's why I said a long rest could be beneficial for you. Uh, I can get some wood. Yeah, I haven't really lost a lot of Not cards, this turn. But, uh... I can heal myself, though. Attack two. Okay, I think the plan is I just need to get in there. So I need to get one, two. I need to get at least a three. So I can... I think I might just use my big move. Yeah, I'm going to use these two. My stunning ability and wounding. And then I'll use a uh, movement so I can get in the room decently far. Actually, if I jump, can that help me here? Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Well, long rest is done. Six would get me there. Yeah, but I don't want to use... I, I'd rather use this card, or that card for... Yeah, I don't think we'll all get on there this round, so... I'd rather be able to do some damage. Oh, true. Or do I just want to get there? Hmm. If I use that to move six... I don't need to heal, though. Uh, I mean, but I would be in the range of two enemies, and I could do this. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. I still kind of want to go slightly slower, just so that the my summons move. Actually, what is your speed there, bud? Uh, two. He would get in the doorway. Okay. Um, not a huge deal then. He's gonna get lit up anyway. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just rotate this over here. I'll try and go fast. He'll move away. Have you played Actually, as this character before, Dodds? Yes. Yes, quite a bit. That was my first character I played with uh, Zantok, and uh, my, basically my second campaign. I played them all the way from level 1 to level 7. We just gotta Is there any character that you there. haven't played at all? Hmm. Um... Aside from some of the uh, Jaws of the Lion characters, the only ones I haven't played are Doomstalker, Night Shroud, because everybody freaking takes them immediately. So we. <laughs> Excuse me? And that's it. I only I picked Night Shroud because Zantok said, like, the character I'm unlocking is a character that I think Zoe would enjoy. And so I'm like, okay, well, I'm going to play that character. And what draws a lion one haven't you played? Um, I have not played Demo or Void Warden. Demo's pretty fun. Yep. Is the saw in the wrong one? What? Mm, At the back no. here. Is it draws a lion character? No, these aren't all Jaws. Yeah, it's just the oh. first four, and then it's just... I think they're just to make them kind of even. Oh, okay. 
Which it is annoying that there's one that doesn't make it even. Um, yeah, I was. I don't know what I would go with next. Yeah, thank uh, my God, Blade Swarm will, will still be around for a while because his my conditions for him is I can't even I can't even progress toward right now. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure what I would go with next. I'm trying not because <laughs> I don't know who else I'd play after this one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure what I'd want to do. Nice if we uh, we managed to if a uh, Ross even managed to come out. Yeah, so I definitely wouldn't play anything that someone has played during our campaign. So, Bladesworn be out, Beast Tyrant, Soothsinger, Nitra, Doomstalker. Play pretty much that whole row, besides Diviner. Um, this one would be out. Summoner would be an option, but I think I've done enough summoning. Uh, Sunkeeper would be I'm an option. I'm pretty sure it's Sunkeeper is the one that Xan took. Yeah, he wants to do that one. Elementalist has been done, and Jawline is kind of... I did one, and I kind of would like to avoid them for a little bit. Mm -hmm. um, Berserker wouldn't be too bad. Quartermaster wouldn't be bad. And then the main Honestly, six... Berserker and Quar Quartermaster's whole thing is that he's... You didn't seem to care for the item idea of a Quartermaster, but if you didn't want to go that route, you can always just build them with infinite cards, basically. Yeah. And then, actually, I think <laughs> our be beginning good. six are all done. Yep. yep. Mm -hmm. so we really, only have... Four characters that we haven't played as now. Yeah, well, Quartermaster, five, Berserker. But one is somebody that is already thinking about Sunkeeper and Summoner. Yeah, those those four are the only original ones and that have not Diviner. been played. He's that's not original. It's a DLC. Oh. Yeah, so those four, and then it would be we have two from Jaws of the Lion that haven't been played. No, one just the Void Warden, mm -hmm. and then the Diviner. So six total have not been played. It would be cool if we got to see all of them be played, though. But we're probably going to play the Jaws of the Lion game, aren't we? Yeah, so that's kind of why I'm okay with not yeah. picking one of those guys. <laughs> it would be really, like, funny if, like, we, we all had to, like, play as new characters and the other people had to pick our characters, like... Mike had to pick for Dodds, Dodds had to pick for Xantog, Xantog had to oh pick boy. for me, and, like, that sort of thing. Because we could either screw each other over or, like, help each other and be like, oh, I'll give you a character that you wanted to try. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know. That would be difficult. <laughs> like, got to pick everything about them, like, all their card picks. Like, oh, oh dear God. I don't, I don't know about that, everything. though. <laughs> I don't know about that, because you kind of want to get slightly attached. You know, pick your how you want to play it. Could be a fun challenge. Yeah. I, man, I can't believe we only... Like, even... we There's only four of the main game that we have not done. Hold up, what did you just say? I said I can't mm -hmm. believe there's only four from the main no, game. No, no, before that. What was your, like, challenge thing? Oh, the thing that I said. Yeah. Um, that if we did a thing where, like, um, like, so Xantok had to pick for, like, Mike, and then Mike had to pick for me, and, so like, I had to pick Zantok's for you, and then you everybody. had to pick for, um, like, you know. You realize that, uh, those, that those two are just gonna troll each other with their mm -hmm. least favorites. Like, you're yeah. gonna end up with Summoner, uh, we're gonna end up with a Summoner, um, uh, he would totally get summoned, who hates yeah. his, who hates his summons, we're gonna end That's... up with a Diviner who doesn't read his cards. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And um, then I, and you and I are actually going to give decent picks mm -hmm. to each other. Yeah, That's why we we're... wouldn't let them pick each other's. <laughs> and we would have to pick theirs, and they would have uh, to pick ours. But while we're waiting, so that yeah, way they can't we're waiting for Zantaki stepped away for whatever reason. But also, reason, like, so if we did that, and, like, chatting. they had to pick, like, which cards they had to, like, so, like, you know how you can only have a certain amount of cards? We had, like, they had the to pick what stopped. cards they could keep in their hand, what items they got, and everything like that. That's so quiet. Hmm. I'll try the next one down. There's some of these songs I never play, so I'm curious about some of them. I just thought it'd be like a weird thing, you know, like how what when people are playing like shooting games and all that, they like switch sensitivity levels and all that. Uh, well, while he's gone, uh, do we kind of want to maybe decide what our next one will be, just so we're kind of doing something That's in the not meantime? A good idea, actually. Because I don't think we unlock so... any new ones. Unless that no, we don't. The, this, so how this was supposed to be, 
Um, we were supposed to go through the abandoned sewers, and then we could have gone to either f unlock water breathing, or we go through the deep ruins mm. to uh, get to the uh, ancient cistern. Okay. Um, let's see. Um, Don't we also so... have the Son of Zoran things that we can do? Those little side ones? <gasps> True! I didn't think that. I didn't think about that. Uh, we should have added that. I think. Is it just the one? No, it's three. Add, I'm trying to think if we added all that stuff in. Oh, I three. think it was added, but we were doing different stuff for other people to retire, so that's why we didn't go towards it. Hmm. I mean, it should still be visible. Yeah, so there's one up in Gloomhaven. And then the third one's down here at 01, and I don't know where the second one is. Uh... So really, we kind of, once we kind of get this envelope, we've kind of gone through most of the unlockables, um, it seems like. So everything else is just kind of, you know, to see everything and do all the scenarios. Because otherwise, we're doing, main story would be um, Scenario 51, which I'm okay with waiting, to be fair. Because um, mm -hmm. I, I, I want to see them all, you know, is the goal. Right. But... I was just um, thinking because the Son of Zoran are like things that Xantok and you yourself, Dodds, haven't even seen, right? Correct. Yes, I haven't seen that. And also we have not gone down one of the battlements pathways. Oh, mm. we can do that next. It's, I want to let you know right now, it's the evil way. Which, oh, I, mean, I mean, considering we're at 20, I don't think we're going to worry about, we're going to worry about next. Say, I'm okay with 20. being evil if we need to be. I also think that because what the son of Zoran is, that could be evil too. Um, but yeah, I'd be okay with doing the battlements that you guys haven't done. That sounds fun. Oh, there's number two in the water. Water. In the water. water. <laughs> you judge it the way I speak. A little bit, yeah. Water. I'll say, or there's always so, the Doom, Doom Trench, because that one just sounds cool. So I am going to repeat the messages that I sent to Dodds when Zoe was or talking about her little idea and those messages were veto, 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 <laughs> veto, veto, no, fuck no, not happening, I quit. He only sent me, he only sent me the, uh, um, veto, so. I sent five messages that just said veto, and that's what prompted me to go like, wait, Zoe, what the fuck are you talking about? Mm. Anyway, flip them. <laughs> Alright, so Bladeswarm, you're up first this round. Right, none of my summons move because there's no enemies, which is perfect, that was what I was hoping fuck. for. Um, Alright, and then I'm going to use the bottom of Sunstroke, even though I really like that card, uh, to move six with jump, and then I'll get to attack uh, two for all adjacent enemies. Uh, I'm going to open the door. Alright. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm going to be on the pressure plate. Uh, Alright, so I get to attack both of these dudes for a base of two, I think? Yes, okay. Um, let's start with the uh, cannon. And uh, you know what? I'm going to add my Sword of the Sands. During the entire, atta uh, entire attack, I get to add Poison and Wound. So, bo so both of these guys will get Poison and Wounded. Um, Alright, so let's start with the cannon. Is there anything else I want to add? All right, plus one to the cannon, so that is three damage, and he'll be poisoned and wounded. I'll get those after. And then the golem, same thing, three damage. And then, because I'm there, I'm going to use deflecting blades to attack both of them again. And it'll be a base of three this time. We'll just do the same order with the artillery first. Miss the artillery. And critted the golem, so it'll be six damage. Uh, Devin off the poison rat. Uh, it'd be eight because he, because it's doubled. Hang on, well no, hang hang on. You said seven damage and uh, no no I need the number. Poison happens before the crit. 
Okay, so it would be so six. What was the total? Uh, six for the base, seven with poison. Okay, then it's four. Six was the base? Holy shit. Oh, well, that was with the double. No, I said... Mm. Okay, four with poison. Poison is before the double. Four with poison. Okay. Okay, so then it double it to eight. There we go. Um, what do they do in this round? Strong attack. Immobilizing. And then the artillery is immobilizing. Um, I'll just tank it. I'll be fine. All right, that's okay. my turn. All right. I am going to be using curative mixture, and I'm going to kick up my boots. So now I'm on the pressure blade, and I'm also going to hit my cannon with hamstring. And I think I'll throw on the jagged sword, get some wound. Well, that's dumb. Oh, well. That's dumb. What do you think I felt about oh, picking okay. up all the elements with my uh, attack cards? Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Well, that's six damage and mega wound. <laughs> cool. Glad to know I have wasted my sword. Awesome. All right. Uh, spell weaver. Okay, uh, Zoe, you're going to be healing up to full, mm -hmm. and I'm picking up light with this, and uh, I'm getting all my cards back, which means, uh, which also includes Freezing Nova, because I just used it, and it just went into my lost pile. Congratulations. And it created dark. Yep, dark also went up. All right, next turn we are going in and destroying things. Well, we don't even need to destroy things, do mm -hmm. we? Just need to send on that pressure plate. Correct. I don't want but to we, just... <laughs> we destroy things. Artillery time. Mm -hmm. Let me get the immobilizers ready. Yeah, you might as well get some out. Uh, I'm being shot first, though. Uh, and that is going to be a two damage to me. Wouldn't I have and been then... shot first by the? Actually, no. Oh, I didn't. I wasn't even thinking about the uh, that one there. Uh, so yes, you are going to be shot by him first. That was minus one. So it's still two damage to you. Uh, one after shield. No, no. I'm sorry. Not two damage because he doesn't have disadvantage. So it's three damage to you. Okay. So two after shield. Yep. And now I draw one more card. Okay, the negative one applies to me, so two damage to me still. And now yours one shoots you. No, here shoots you now. I already did the one shooting me, dumbass. This guy shoots twice, dumbass. Oh, motherfucker. Okay, well then here's the fucking problem. Okay, then this the plus one and the curse is what applies to that one shooting me then. So then it's the negative one and the zero that's hitting you. So now it's two damage to you. Wait, he already shot me, though. There is a third cannon in the room. Oh, this yeah. This one shot you, then it shot me, then this one shot me, now oh. this one shoots you. Two damage. Two damage, one after shield. And they both take wounds. Doop. Doop. Stone Golem. That is going to be five damage to you. Four up to shield. And that is going to be six damage to me. I'm going to use my ring, and I'm going to remember, oh, right, steam armor. I could have been using that. Oh. So, so I'm, going to, I'm going to take one damage total. Huzzah. And then my defense are long rest. End the round. All right. Uh, I have an idea here. I'm going to do this, where I get Nothing to attack for cannon. a big thing, and I get He's to heal myself. Down. They're both wounded already, so I don't even need to worry about wound. I could also make sure I don't miss, which would be good. 
Um, because the bottom actions all suck for me. So, yeah, we're going to make sure we don't miss. I mean, I could go for XP. I honestly don't care. I'm at a high enough level. I mean, yes, I could get to level 9, but I have a feeling we'll see Blade Swarm at level 9, so don't worry about it. Yeah, that's just another option. Uh, but yeah, that's why I've been doing lots of summons There's for this one ability. I get my battle goal here, but I'm not strictly counting on it. Flip them. All right, artillery is going to push. Oh. That's annoying. And stone golem is going to hit all adjacent. Mine thief. I see we both wanted to go fast. Yep. <laughs> Well, I'm just going to take dark, but I'll leave ice for you to use. Oh, um, there's I'm also light there. I'm, I'm using fire orbs, I'm not using the... Uh... Ah, okay. Well, I'm going to use frigid aspiration to move four and open the door with two. And let's see what the bad boys are doing. Oh, you're standing there? Uh, no, I'm not going to say that. I just want to see what they're doing before I... Okay. Alright. Bo bones are going to shield and heal. Spirits move, attack, and heal. Hmm. Mother... Well, I can only stun one, Dodds. Who would you prefer me to stun? Um, Probably the elite spirit. Do you have enough movement I stunned. can kick my boots up. Yeah, um, yeah stun the uh, elite. Alright, so and that was two that. to get to the door, so I've got three, four, and then three for my boots. So three, four, boop. And I'm going to stun that elite. And that gets lost. And then I'm using Shed Nightmare. I'm going to consume the dart dupe and ices up. They're getting two curses. And who shall I attack? Attack the spirits or attack the bones? The bones aren't doing anything this turn. So. Yeah, they're, they're going to be healing up anyways. Attack the spirits. I'm going to attack both of the normals because I don't want to do disadvantage on the elite. Mm. And so I will go mm -hmm. six, then four. Survey says plus zero, so just three. And then the other one is minus one, so no damage. Alright. But they're both poisons. Spellweaver. Okay. Um. I thought I had more movement, and I th also thought they were going to be closer. That's what we're going to work be as close. Kind of kicking myself for not uh, doing my extra movement guard, but uh, it's fine. I've got other options. Okay. Can't stand on the door. There we go. Shooting both of the skeletons with the fire orb. Uh, top to bottom, by the way. Um, that's going to be three damage. Might as well just uh, leave them with one less because they're going to be healing immediately after me. And then no damage. Well, one damage, but it's going to be fully, fully healing. So, yeah. Got two experience for it. That's all that matters. All right. Sawbones. <sighs> I am going to use the amputate to hit the golem. There's no point in hitting the artillery. 
minus one. So three damage, wounds, and immobilize. One has to resolve that shield. Boo. All right, living bones. They will all do some healing. And they have shield one. Artillery. Push. Uh, and now they're going to shoot us. That, that's fun. Okay. Miss on me. And that's going to be three damage on the Blade Swarm. Two after shield. And then we get wound here and wound here. No damage to me. Man, you are getting lucky. Then you are getting four damage. Yeah. <laughs> Three after shield. All right. Hey, Blade Swarm. Yeah. Uh, my buggies all move. This guy would go this way, which is perfect. I want him far away. This guy is now in the doorway. He's going to get drunk and fall over, it looks like. Yep. All right. Uh, so... Him moving me was rude. Uh, I'm going to... Oh, right, I'm immobilized. Yeah, him moving me just screwed up everything. I don't think I can do anything. Yeah. Yep, that wasted my big card. Oof. Um... Oh, yeah, I can't do anything. Uh... I think, well, in that case, I'm going to use my healing potion to heal five. Uh, I might have to go invisible here. Um, man, that sucks. Uh, I'll just, I'll stay invisible. That'll be it for me. All right, moving spirits. Hi, friends. Uh, so this one is going to be stunned, so he does nothing. Oh, and these people are going to attack our little oh. mind thief. Mm -hmm. That's going to be four damage on the first one. And then it'll heal its poison away. And then that's going to be five damage on the second one. Which card do I want to get rid of? Ooh. You can go away. Okay. All right. Stone golems. Well, thankfully this one's mobilized. So I'm going to take its wound. And this one takes its wound. And that is going to be three damage. Two after shield. In the round. Um, we can okay. probably end this this round if. Uh, I gotta. Oh, I gotta get rid of these. Um, I gotta the use land this. I think. Uh, move two, attack three. Do you want me to go stand two. on it? Um, yeah, because I ha I have to get that to move back um, there. You'd have to go to the bottom one. And then I would just use a top okay. action just to fight something it's here. A bit Probably of a waste this of experience for me, but I've gotten quite a bit already, so. Yeah, I'm just gonna punch the thing and go invisible if I have to. Probably better so that way those two don't keep getting slammed. I could None use of them jump, are mobilized, so I can go stand on their pressure fine. plates again if they want. Unless the artillery go fast enough and immobilize us again. That's true. Let's plan for it at the end, though. They're not immobilizing. Woo. They are pushing, though. I mean, I'm after them, so I don't care. I'm not. Blade Swarm. <laughs> I'm not. Uh, I'm going to use the bottom of uh, my Vampire Tempest uh, to move to. 
Uh, so I'm just going to go back here. That allows me to attack as well. Attack 3 immobilize. So let's just do that real Oh, wait, hold on. I have other things that have to go. You go there, you go there. Do you get in range of anything? Oh, you do. Uh, that guy gets in range. Uh, he attacks first. Phase 3. Rolling heal. Of course he gets the heal. Uh, 5 damage to that golem. Alright. Uh, now my attack 3 on the other golem. Oh, there's a rolling heal. Cool. Plus 1 poison. Uh, so that would be 4 damage to him. Uh, 5 with poison. Yep, he's gone. And that... Ability allows me to move again, so I'm gonna step there on the pressure plate. Uh, so that's gone. And then, I mean, I might as well punch the cannon, cause I might as well. Do I have anything to help here? Nope. Uh, plus one wound, so that's three damage to that cannon. Including the poison? No, four. Then yeah, he's he's gone. Then it's gone. And then just to make sure nothing happens to me, I'm going invisible. All right, Mind Thief. Okay, I'm going to use the bottom of Dark Frenzy to move three and just go one, two to here. And then no, I, get... I said I needed that one. Oh, you do? Hey, I, I, said, I said you need to go to the bottom one, not the... Ah, boop, boop, I'll move here instead then. Bloop. It doesn't bother me. Um, and dupe doesn't really matter, but well, actually, experience does. Um, and then I get to shoot something, and I will shoot Skelly Boy, this one, for a base of three. And survey says disarm, rolling, model rolling. Uh oh, here it comes. Yep. Yeah, miss. <laughs> yep, that just checks out. Yeah, I I only had six cards left in my deck, and I hadn't seen it yet, so yeah. Um, And then I'm going to use Brain Leech to attack four on something, and I'm going to attack Living Bonesy Boy again, I guess, because why not? Um, And Survey says for that one... There crit. you go. So that's eight damage to him. To the spirit? Or no, the keys, you're still in skeleton. Yeah. Okay. Yep. And then I get to heal myself four. One, two, three, four. I get to experience and create dark. And that's loss. Alright. Spellweaver. Okay. Moving one, two, three, four. And I'm shooting with Impaling Eruption. And uh, going to be using my Piercing Bow on this. No shield on those spirits. Disadvantage on the first one. Gonna go closest to farthest. Um, only two damage on that one. Fortunate. And the closest one. Closest, yeah. Yeah. You two damage they have their shield. No shield. I have no shield. Yeah. Uh, I use piercing bow. Then three damage. Oh my you're kidding. I didn't kill two a damage. single one. Two damage. <laughs> yeah, how had a feeling. I need to get a better deck. I really hey, you're, need you're, to improve my deck. Yeah, yours this have is... been pretty rough. Do you have any more things that remove any bad cards? Yep. Uh, no, actually. Oh, no. wow. I've already removed all the bad stuff. I just... Mm. Yeah. They don't have a good... They really don't have a good perk list, to be honest. Alright. Well, um, that was three experience, at least. Alright. Okay. That brings us to the uh, living spirits who aren't happy. And they're still living. And they're... <laughs> All three of them are hitting both of you. Yep. So mm -hmm. that's unfortunate. That's going to be a miss. Uh, that's going to be three damage to the Spellweaver. Uh, that is going to be 
one damage to the they move away first. Hmm. One damage to the mind thief. Yep. Of course, can't see the goddamn thing. Uh, it's gonna be three damage to the spell weaver. He would have to attack one of us at disadvantage. No, he wouldn't. He, he's moving. Oh. Go there, though. Hmm. Well, that's going to be a crit, so... But I can use my armor. Not on... Yes, it says when attacked. Uh, no, because he's starting to help spell over first, because that's who uh... he was next to. Yeah. I thought he would attack so me. No. Because he was next to Spellweaver when their turn started, so he's still targeting Spellweaver first. Thank regardless you. of where he was after the movement. So four names to Spellweaver. Yep. I dropped a card for that. Gotcha. <laughs> One damage to Mind Thief. Yep. I'm about to take three shots from the uh, skeleton. So, Dodge, you're the me in this room, and Zoe's the Xantok <laughs> in this room. Well, speaking of the you, I, uh, I this artillery dies. Yay. And the other one is just going to shoot me. Uh, my golem is actually there first. Oh, it is. But it's an well, air, that yeah. is going to be three damage to the golem then. Does it hit you with area? Yeah, it's. I'm not that far away. Uh, but then it's also just going to be two damage to me. Now I'm going to make it one because my armor. All right, my turn. And I'm going to hit the golem with a gentleman's anger. Ooh. Crit. It's gone. All right, stone golem. Oh, wait. He's gone. Living bones. You guys just gotta survive. That's all you gotta do. Bro, well, I'm fine. It's... Yeah, it's disarmed. <laughs> <laughs> There's gonna be three damage with the spell weaver for the first okay. attack. Oh god. There's gonna be three damage to the spell weaver for the second attack. Hard. And that's gonna be four damage for the spell weaver for the third attack. Hard. Ouch. And then this one <laughs> this is disarmed. Oh, that Hi, was buddy. that was actually a little rougher than I thought it would be. Huh. So at this point, I've failed my battle goal. Ah. Uh. Wait, no! I didn't realize we were all in our things. I succeeded. Kill the last monster to die in the scenario. Oh yeah, you did. I thought we were gonna have one more turn. I didn't realize you hit your pressure plate. Mm -hmm. We're on the line of pressure plates. I did not think that was going to happen. Awesome. Well, with the last switch depressed, the alarm finally, thankfully, subsides. The cannon's lights go off and their guns point downward, lying dormant. The machinery sputters and dies, the cogs stopping their rotation. Within a matter of seconds, the entire chamber becomes as dead as it was before, leaving you to continue to explore in peace. Heading down a narrow passage at the back of the left room, you find the corridor descends into a pool of brackish liquid. You can see a vague light in the distance under the water. A quick swim should take you further into this underground world, which unlocks global achievement, ancient technology, our fifth and final, and party achievement through the ruins. Mm -hmm. And then scenario 26, if we haven't we've, done that one already. Yeah, we've already done it. That's weird. It yeah, I like thought a, we might have. Didn't have a thing on it. Yeah, I think it's supposed to, but printing issues sometimes, you know? Zoe, where's 26? It's oh, ancient right system. Right. It's yeah. already done. End of the scenario. Yay! Wee! All the things. I'm, uh, so, I'm so close to leveling up! I failed mine. My battle got... I got mine. Which was to loot and monster's token um, in the same round as killing it. Mm. I get a perk, so I'm going to do it. add a plus two roll rate. Because that's fun. That, that's pretty good. 
Do we get a tick for oh, yeah. completing that scenario? Yes. Yeah, you do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Yay, every time you start, you get a tick. I get a perk then, too. Don't forget to remove your three minus ones. I'm going to add two plus one rolling cup. Uh, Dots, did you uh, get a perk this round or no? Nope. Oh. Or right, did you complete your battle goal? Yeah, it was just one, though. What was yours again? I just needed to have two uh, elements up. Oh, right, 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 yeah. Easy. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna delete the board. Nobody My hands are dumb. up. My hands Good. are up. Good. Never trust the children. <laughs> Alright. Yay. So, uh, let's do the city of it first. Yup. Return to Gloomhaven after your latest outing. You approach for the captain of the guard at the city gates. Ah, I was hoping I might catch you here sooner or later, he says. I've still been receiving reports about large flying lizards from the scouts. Tell me, have you gotten to the bottom of that situation yet? Option A, <laughs> lie, and say that you are still working on it. Or option B, tell the captain you decided not to kill the Elder Drake. Um. Uh, <laughs> awkward. See, this is a fun one because I don't know what's beyond this car, and both of these options could be like, oh, uh, oops. I know. I'm trying to think. Like, I feel like A is gonna be like, uh, oh, okay, then get on it, you know. But nothing happens. B might have a negative consequence, but it has something, you know. Or it could be maybe it unlocks another card. Ugh. Or he might give us something to help with it. <laughs> Dang it. Oh, I don't know. Zoe, what are you thinking? Lie, lie, lie. <laughs> <laughs> well, Zantok, you haven't done this one. You do have a say in it, then. I... I actually want to tell him the truth. I think that'd be an interesting to see his reaction. Oh, that leaves it on me, because Dodds has probably seen this before. Yeah, unfortunately. <laughs> Funny enough, I kind of want to tell him the truth as well. Yeah, I, th I think we're going to tell the truth here. Oh! My! Oh. Well, uh... Okay. The captain looks at you with stunned curiosity. So, there's a massive... Fire-breathing Drake up the mountains, and you decided there was no reason to kill it. Interesting. The captain wanders off, mumbling about needing to find better help. This is to your reputation. Aww. And we all knew we were going to be getting something negative there. Yeah. The other oh. One, oh, we still lost one reputation on the other oh, one. Oh, and it would have gone back wow. in. So I'm okay with this. This is actually the best scenario. I don't think that one should have gone should go back in either, because you could still kill it, and this car wouldn't make sense anymore. Right. Well, no, I guess. No, mm, technically, no. you're not supposed you're not supposed to be able to kill it. Right. Once you decide right. it, it's done. All right. Did anybody level up? Nope. Nope. Mm -hmm. Cool. Very well then. We have gained five ancient technologies that can now finally, after all this time, open envelope. A. Woo! Woo! Ooh. Oh. Now, here's the thing with this oh. card. I don't know what this says. We never translated this because Dodds never told me how. I'll say, yeah, this is different. So I don't know what this is. I've never known. So, Dodds, uh, can you finally fucking enlighten me? Or am I still going to be left in the dark? All right, so... Um... <laughs> Let me, let me find the uh, link for it again. Ah. Uh, yep. So, as you probably noticed, these symbols don't match up with uh, your cipher. Right. Mm -hmm. Apparently, 
Okay, this give isn't it enough... solvable. Oh. It's it's, un it's unsolvable or until. I think I can either... brute force this. It takes me a while, no. but I think I could break brute force it. The light came. I, apple. <laughs> But, but it probably, you know, that is most likely a T, and then you could kind of figure it out from there. Once you get one word, that's all you need. And then you can start piecing together. I mean, together. You're, you're assuming, you're assuming here that the symbols are actually printed correctly as well. That's true. But I, it would take a long time, and I don't really want to do it, so. I feel like the second row first word is probably end. Mm, yeah, that makes sense. Of. But anyway, so are we just? Um, yeah, I, I'm okay let with. Let me see if I can. It. I'm trying to find the uh, text for it again. Um. Yeah. I don't understand why you told me it wasn't that exciting. Yeah. Because <laughs> it's technically not. Uh, Usable from what I remember. Um, yeah, um, I don't think it's uh, solvable. It, 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 it's it's called envelope A. Yeah, yeah. There's. Envelope A is not something that's usable in this game. I believe it was. I, I believe either it's intended to be used for Founders of Gloomhaven or it's going to be used in Frosthaven. Oh. What the hell is Founders of Gloomhaven? Founders of Gloomhaven is. It's a tile placement uh, action uh, board game. Hmm. It's more of it's more of a like a city builder kind of thing. Because the idea is, it's way back when Gloomhaven was just about to, was just getting founded. Yeah, the Dakota right. card that is included in the second printing on the back of a thank you note in the printing of the first edition Kickstarter. Basically, this is for purchases of the first printing retail edition. Yep. Which is stupid. Yep. Oh, well, that's that's I don't... quite the letdown. Yep, so, um, instead, we can try and come up with some other kind of reward for this, because, obviously, doing all that work and getting all five is kind of a bit of a letdown. Hmm. So, Either. yeah, well, we'll try and come up with something to kind of homebrew brew some kind of uh, reward for this, because, obviously, nobody wants a reward for nothing. Uh, nobody wants a nothing reward, so. Yeah. I mean, the only thing that sounds like it would fit is free random blues, but there's only four of them left. I was thinking uh, free um, enhancement. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, free enhancement or free See, I, I considered free enhancement, but it's ancient technology that would unlock right. it. And that's not enhancements. That's yeah. technology. We'll try and come up with something. Uh, that said, though... Um, what are we doing next? Yeah, did you two figure out exactly where you wanted to go? Well, I gave suggestions. Uh, Ruby I mentioned my Battleman. suggestion. <laughs> did you mention Battleman or we were looking to the... Uh, um, what was your suggestion, Zoe? I said Staff the of Zorn. Son of Zorn. Yes, oh, Son I'm okay Zorn. with those two. Zorn, Staff of Zorn thing. The socks. The socks. Now, did we actually unlock those? Because I didn't see what your card said for that. That was what mm, It said it unlocked them. What? I'm pretty sure the thingy my bubby said it unlocked it. So that's the part I don't know, because we don't have them there. That's why I'm like, I don't know if we can do those. Did we never click this bonus content button? No, we did. I swear we did. Well, why don't you click it to see what happens? Boop. Oh, Secrets were in City event. Okay. We didn't. Thought we did. Yeah. 
So Dang sad in some city events. So maybe this will be our award. <laughs> we just read the first city event. And then the other ones will get shuffled in. Yeah. I say immediately, because we were supposed to shuffle these in. So. Yeah. The other ones we won't read, just the fur. Whoa. That was weird. It's, just, it's time. Yeah. All right. So. About to set out into the wilderness beyond the city walls, your attention is caught by the whispered beckoning of a nervous-looking guard standing on patrol. Citizens! I hear you lot are a particularly effective gang of do-gooders. Well, I have a proposition. My captain tasked me to check out reports of a disturbance at an old noble family crypt. Ah, oh, awesome. Residents reported some strange goings-on late at night. On approaching it during my shift, I heard the screams of something unnatural, and it chilled me right to my bones. By the oak, I don't think I can go back there. Option A, ask for further <laughs> details from the guard, or option B, ignore the rambling fool and carry on. A. Option B is just so, like... I vote B. Right? A, A, A Option B is A. just so, like, you just don't want to deal with any nonsense, you know? You're just like, I don't care about this guy. Uh, yeah, A, obviously. Plot hook. All right. I'm really curious about the other one, though. <laughs> oh, we'll look okay. at it. The story feels familiar. Like the memory of a tale you heard as a child. Read out can be. Okay. Oh. That's weird. So ignoring him was the correct option. <laughs> okay. As you pass the anxious guard, you can't help but feel unhinged by his story. Upon approaching the boundary of the corpsewood, Intrusive thoughts start to plague your mind, like a whisper of paranoia from the voice of a mute. You sigh, and begrudgingly convince your party to double back to the East Barracks. The intensity of his teary-eyed excitement to see you again is thankfully outweighed by his promise of some coin for the job. Wow. Unlock Noble's Crypt at C-19. I like how they're That's pretty much so like, no, you're going to get it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And I just like how the also, actual... Also, it's weird because it's like, Oh, only only read this part if you complete that person quest. Like that's the only way we can add this card. But okay, it's kind of dumb. Oh, it doesn't have a picture. It? Oh, you double click it, sir. No, no, I don't. I don't ever do that. I I usually just get it onto the map. It doesn't have a but picture. But it doesn't that's have why. a picture. Yeah. Error in script. Ooh, that don't. So it well. doesn't load the scenario. Ooh. Mm. So these are broken. Ooh, Zoe's fault. Uh, so, Dodds, mm -hmm. you have a, we gotta spend some time this week, I guess, and build it, and I'm not looking forward to that, because this means this one's not going to have a lot of automation that we normally like. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> well, in that case, see you all next time. Bye, Bye everyone. <laughs>